Hey there, dog lovers. Have you ever felt uneasy when your dog gives you a prolonged stare? You're not alone. That intense gaze might be a warning sign. And today we're going to explore why dogs stare at you and what it could mean for your relationship with your pup. Stick around, you won't want to miss this. 1. Understanding eye contact. All right, let's talk about how dogs communicate through eye contact. Dogs are social animals and they express a bunch of feelings and thoughts with their eyes. When your dog looks at you, it's like they're starting a silent chat with you. Pack dynamics. Dogs come from wolves. They have inherited the importance of eye contact from their pack behavior. In a pack, looking into each other's eyes means trust and respect. So when your dog looks at you, it's like they're saying, you're part of my pack. It's all about building trust and togetherness. Understanding emotions. Dogs are good at picking up on how we feel. When they look into your eyes, it's not just about them showing their emotions. They're also trying to figure out how you're feeling. This understanding helps create a strong emotional connection between you and your dog. If you pay attention to how your dog looks at you, you can figure out what they're feeling and what they want. As we keep going, we'll explore situations where this eye contact might mean something different, like a warning. Don't forget to hit subscribe and stay tuned. 2. Understanding trust and bonding. Now, let's dig deeper into why your dog's stare is often a heartwarming sign of trust and a building block for a strong bond. Emotional connection. Dogs are highly emotional beings and their eyes are a window to their feelings. When your dog looks at you for a long time, it shows how much they care about you. It's like a shared understanding of the love and friendship that makes your bond strong. Pack loyalty. In the wild, animals in a group depend on trust to get along. When your dog looks at you, especially when things are calm, it shows they trust you as their pack leader. This trust makes them feel safe and being part of your family. Shared experiences. Every time you do things together with your dog, your connection gets stronger. Whether you're taking a walk, playing fetch, or just hanging out, the way your dog looks at you becomes a sign of all the good times you've had and the happiness of being together. 3. The warning signs. Although it feels nice when your dog looks at you with love, it's important to notice when that look might mean something else. Let's talk about when your dog's intense gaze could be a sign that something might be wrong. Discomfort or anxiety. Prolonged staring, especially when they also show signs like being all tense, licking their lips, or yawning, could mean they're not feeling great. This might happen if they're in a new place, around people they don't know, or when things in their routine change. Fearful stare. When a dog is scared, you might notice them looking at you with wide eyes, big pupils, and a lower body stance. If they think there's something scary or they feel frightened, they might stare to figure out what's going on or to show that they're not feeling comfortable. Resource guarding. Dogs like to have their own space, and if your dog gives you a serious or protective look, it might mean they're guarding their food, toys, or personal area. It's important to notice this warning sign especially if you have more than one pet or kids in your home. Aggression warning. If your dog is giving you a really strong and focused look with a stiff body, it might be a sign of aggression. This could mean your dog feels threatened and they might act aggressively if they think the threat is still there. So when you face this situation, give them space and walk away. It's really important to pay attention to what's happening around your dog and how they're acting when they look at you. If you notice warning signs, it helps you figure out what's bothering your dog and what to do about it. 4. Understanding your dog body language. Now that we've touched upon the warning signs of a dog's stare, let's go deeper into understanding how dogs communicate. Paying attention to these small signs can help you understand what your dog is thinking or feeling. Tail language. Watch your dog's tail carefully. If it's wagging, it doesn't always mean they're happy. A high, stiff, wagging tail might show excitement or tension, while a low, tucked tail could mean your dog is scared or submissive. To understand what your dog is saying, look at their tail along with their stare. That way, you'll get a better idea of what's going on. Ears and hackles. Look at your dog's ears and the hair on their back for more clues. If their ears point forward and the hair on their back stands up, it might mean they're alert or excited. On the other hand, if their ears are flat and their hackles are up, it could mean they're scared or getting ready to act aggressively. If you look at how your dog acts along with how they stare, you'll understand them better. 
Dogs don't just talk with their eyes, it's everything they do. Being aware of their body language helps you communicate well and understand them. 5. Tips and Solutions Now that we've explored why dogs look at you and what the warning states are, let's get into some useful tips and solutions. Knowing how to react to your dog's signals can help you have a good and friendly relationship with your pup. Respect their space. If your dog's stare seems to be a warning sign, respect their personal space. Give them room to retreat if they feel uncomfortable, and avoid pushing them into situations that cause stress. Recognizing and respecting their boundaries is key to building trust. Training and socialization. Invest time in training and socializing your dog with various environments, people, and animals. This helps them feel more confident and less likely to give scared or aggressive stares. Introduce new things slowly and make sure they have good experiences. This will help your dog become well-behaved and friendly. Consult a professional. If your dog's stare comes with aggressive behavior, fear, or keeps happening, it's a good idea to talk to a professional dog trainer or behavior expert. They can check what's going on, give you advice that fits your situation, and use tricks to help with any problems your dog might have. Regular vet checkups. Sometimes, when your dog acts differently, including staring, it might be because of health problems. Going to the vet regularly helps catch any physical issues or pain early on, making sure your dog stays healthy and happy. Create a safe space. Make a special safe spot for your dog where they can go when they need a break and feel safe. It could be a comfy bed or a crate tucked away in a quiet place. Having this safe space lets your dog relax and recharge whenever they need to. Keep in mind that every dog is different, and there isn't a one-size-fits-all solution. Paying attention to what your dog needs and how they act is crucial for building a strong and trusting bond. Using these tips will help you understand your dog better and create a connection that will last a long time. If you found these helpful, click subscribe for more insights and share your own experiences in the comments below. Until next time, happy bonding with your pup and see you in the next video.